Another investigation into Missouri Governor Eric Greitens. Missouri lawmakers forming a committee to determine if Greitens broke the law. Their investigation stems from a grand jury indictment charging the governor with invasion of privacy. And this could be the first step into determining if Greitens should be impeached. 41 Action News reporter Tom Dempsey live in Jeff City now with these late breaking news developments. Tom. Well, Mike, these press conferences all took place within a 20 minute time span. The first, as you said, dealing with a House uh, committee being formed to look into this uh, indictment against Governor Eric Greitens and decide whether or not he should face impeachment proceedings. The second held by two Republican House members all uh, calling on this petition that's been signed by a dozen other lawmakers calling on Governor Eric Greitens to resign as a result of these allegations coming forward. Now, of course, today marks the first day back for state leaders here in Jefferson City since they went on recess, their first day back since this indictment came down. Of course, the indictment all involving a felony invasion of privacy charge against Governor Eric Greitens, uh, allegations uh, claiming that the governor threatened a woman he was having an affair with in St. Louis in 2015, threatening to release a nude picture of that woman. But Governor Eric Greitens has called that a misguided political decision. He's called the indictment that. But lawmakers today in these press conferences saying they hope to get the truth and the facts through this investigation. This committee's task is going to be to investigate facts. We're going to do so in a way that is fair, thorough, and timely. And we're going to do it without any preordained results. The governor appears to have lied to the people of Missouri when he said in January that he had not taken a photograph of a woman who was undressed, blindfolded, and bound. It is hard to see how he can be an effective governor or a leader of the Missouri Republican Party while fighting a criminal case in court. Now, as far as that House committee investigation goes, no timetable was given on when we could get a report or some answers in regards to the investigation. But if the five members decide that Governor Greitens should face impeachment proceedings, it would then move on to the full House for a vote on impeachment. Live in Jefferson City, I'm Tom Dempsey, 41 Action News. Tom, thank you for that.